How to use a Kodak flatbed with your Kodak PS50 or PS80 picture saver scanner. You can use your Kodak A3 or legal size flatbed with your picture saver scanner using the Smart Touch application, SVT, or the picture saver application. Flatbed scanning is useful when you want to scan old, fragile photographs and significantly curled or creased photographs. To start using your flatbed alongside your picture saver scanner, connect both the scanner and the flatbed to the host PC. First, power on the scanner and wait for its light to turn green. Then, power on your flatbed accessory. To use the Smart Touch application to scan from your flatbed, first open up Smart Touch by clicking on its icon and clicking Configure. Next, select Settings and then Settings again. Next, select Device and in the drop down labeled Paper Source, select Flatbed. Press OK and then Apply. Your photographs will now be scanned from your flatbed. Please note that this procedure can also be repeated using SVT. If you want to use your flatbed to scan multiple photographs at a time, use the Picture Saver application along with the Photo Selector Accessory. The Photo Selector Accessory is a feature that can be used in the Picture Saver application that will take the multiple images scanned from your flatbed and separate them into individual documents. To use the Photo Selector Accessory, open the Picture Saver application. First, you must connect both the Photo Selector Accessory Dongle and the correct Picture Saver Dongle for your scanner to your PC. Open the application by clicking its shortcut icon on your desktop. Enter in your order number and press the Continue button. Once in the application, select the Settings button and where it says Flatbed Scan Mode, select Enable Photo Selector. Press OK and then press Flatbed Scan. The flatbed will now scan your photographs. Once the photographs are scanned, the Photo Selector Accessory window will pop up and show you the separated scanned images. You can move and edit where the photos are cut. Press the Return button once you are finished and then save your images. For more information on installing the correct Picture Saver application and flatbed driver, please refer to the How to Install the Picture Saver Application, Photo Selector Accessory, and Kodak Flatbed Driver video.